Welcome to NCDOT Now. I'm Marty Homan. We need you to weigh in on the NCDOT Customer Satisfaction Survey. And we're talking about train safety as Rail Safety Week kicks off. First up. This year, 15 people have died either by walking on tracks or being struck by a train at a railroad crossing in North Carolina. Some of these deaths could have been prevented by following a few safety tips. Always expect a train when coming to a railroad crossing. Modern trains can be difficult to hear coming and trains always have the right of way. It may seem like a cool backdrop, but you should never pose for photos on railroad tracks. Walking on railroad tracks is illegal and can be deadly. Lastly, don't put yourself or others at risk by driving around lowered crossing arms and keep your vehicle behind the white line. The goal of National Rail Safety Week, running from September 22nd to 28th, is to increase awareness and educate the public about railroad safety. NCDOT launched its fourth annual Customer Satisfaction Survey this week, and we want to know what you think. The purpose of the survey is to gauge how the department is performing in its effort to provide great customer service. Responses will help NCDOT identify ways to make North Carolina transportation services safer, more efficient, and customer focused. It takes about 15 minutes to complete and the link is mobile friendly. You have until the end of October to weigh in at NCDOT's website. Lastly, the National Association of State Aviation Officials named NCDOT's drone program as the 2019 most innovative state program at its annual convention last week. There's also time for you to vote for NCDOT's use of drone technology after Hurricane Florence. The department is nominated for an America's Transportation Award. That's all for this week's edition of NCDOT Now. For all of us here at the North Carolina Department of Transportation, safe travels.